Hello. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, actually, I should probably play this with a controller. This is Isles of Seed and Sky. I've been waiting for this for ages. This is by the developer of Triga. Um, I recommend you go and look that up. It, it'll be lost to the sands of time eventually because um, this, this game is going to overshadow it, I think, somewhat. This is a um, puzzle adventure game uh, in the likes of something like a Legend of Zelda, but without combat. So we're going to we're going to check this out and please. OK, good. My controller does work. And I'm going to be doing this blind. This is the kind of game that thrives in uh, exploration, by the way, key provided by the dev. Thank you very much, uh, dev. Love you. You're the best. Thank you. Uh, this game thrives in exploration and discovery and so i am going to do a blind play and we're going to do about half an hour of this and then you can check out uh the link in the description to to try the game yourself i i'm already going to recommend this because i know it's good <laughs> like i've been uh watching it but not too closely because i didn't want to spoil anything myself but i love this kind of game i love the uh, games that thrive in exploration and in discovery things like uh an animal well more recently but, uh, you know, like Outer Wilds, but I, I love a game like this as well, like Back to the Past, when the games were actually pretty good and uh, they often get a bad rap. <laughs> we are moving blocks, and yes, this is a Soko like as, as I understand it. Ooh. We got sparklies and a key. And this is, this is the game introducing some very basic mechanics right now but these are going to become part of our uh language it's you know the games they teach you a language you don't know necessarily like this oh a block can go in a hole and now the, the block is gone you know baba is you comes to mind is a is a game much like this and we have a thing we, ha we have exploration on the right we can't access it yet and uh, apparently we are also seeking for mystical keys all right, so, mm, okay, I, I may not have wanted to do that, but I'm learning, you know, I'm learning. We can't move this rock. You cannot move this rock. And if I move over there and ring that bell, then then I'm going to be stuck. So what I want to do is move on to it and then push this there. Now I can ring the bell. Excellent. But I want this, uh, I want this, ooh. Oh, I, I had a funny feeling something like that was going to happen. I want this uh, log, so I'm going to have to push it from above. And obviously, we're not going to want to push it in such a way that we are uh, killed. There goes my no death run. We've un we've we've opened the key. I like these. Uh, this kind of like moving through the hay brush. Little little uh, detail. Um, can't move this upstairs, I assume. We have a key. We can move down here. What do we got going on down here? Ah, this is our next adventure. Now, what do we want to do here? We uh, This is obviously where things are going to get tricky very quickly. So, how do we want to do this? I just wonder. Hmm... Like, I want to do this in such a way that I can get back. I wonder if there's a uh, reverse time. Okay, there's a reset button. There is a reset button. So, like, you know, for instance, I could go here, push this block, and then move back, and then push this here. I don't know if there's a value in doing it that way. I and mean, then we push this block here, and now we can get back. And we also have a line that we can push this log through so we could push this all the way over here why we would want to do that i don't know in fact it looks like it's actually going to hurt us in a way we can open that up do we want a log do we need a log it's log you know we do like a log so we got we got a key i'm wondering what this is about this this is definitely something you can't tell me that's not something get this key so currently we have three or two keys, but, and I guess we're going to need three keys if we want that star. And we do want this, the star, you know, it's, it's a star. Of course we want it. Why not? Why would we not want it? Tell me. Explain it to me. 
Okay, so interesting. Well, we definitely want to put a, a log on this hole. But do we want to put it on that hole right now? And then what is this? What is this? And we can't do anything with this yet. Um, I assume we want to ring this bell so that we can get to the... Oh, I see. That's going to unblock both of these um, stones. So if I go over here, I ring this. Yeah, it, it unblo unbox both of those and then we get a key. So we're going to need to come back here at some point to get that key. I wonder if we have a map. Do we have a map? We do have a map. Can I make notes on the map? I can make notes on the map. Okay, so um, I, I, I more and more I'm feeling like I, I should, you know, do these things early. So I'm going to put a note on this map to indicate that there's still a key there because we're going to want to come back at, at some point. And obviously there's still a key here. So we'll want to come back to that as well. I notice the little p uh, pit to the pit traps are still here. In fact, the logs are back as well. In fact, everything is back. The traps, the stones, everything. Interesting. Okay. So what are these? Are these anything? They're not. They're nothing. They're nothing. And um, we don't know how to get... I don't know how to get to this star. I feel like there's... I guess the, the trees are, aren't covering anything. They're just two tile-long obstacles for a little bit of extra detail. There's definitely something going on to the northwest over there. So we have three keys. We'll, we'll come back, maybe. Yeah, I mean, we, we only needed one key, and we got three. So, you know, I went above and beyond. New mechanics. New things. Aha! It's a, it's a um, pressure plate. I love me a pressure plate. Love me a pressure plate. Back in my day, pressure plates were all the rage. Now, not so much. I, 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 can't, I can't remember the last time I saw a pressure plate. I'm assuming that I don't necessarily want to push that log down. Let's see. Okay, we don't... I guess I couldn't have pushed it down. Um, well, I'm, I'm kind of stuck with my decision now, so we want to ring this bell. Ah, okay. Mm. The problem is, is I've now destroyed one of our pits. Two of our pits. So I'm not really sure. Okay, I think I see the, I think I see the route. Yeah, 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 I see it. Okay, so we want to stand here, but we don't want to obviously walk on that trap. So then we move this here, and then we can move this over to the other pressure plate. Get the key. Open this up. I don't know why we want to open that up, but we do. We have three keys. We could go to that north block, but let's check out this area. Ooh. Uh, very intimidating looking portal. Portal. And this would get us another key. I, I like getting keys, you know? Really something to be said about getting keys. Now, I'm just curious if there's anything. Oh, the water kills you dead, huh? Ooh, interesting. So, obviously, if I push this up and push it in, then that log is going to be stuck there. I can't really do anything about that. Um, so, I don't know if I can do anything here yet. We'll figure it out later. But what is this? So, this teleports this to us to this location. We can ring this bell. Um, problem is, is that now, we, yeah, we have to come back down. Let's go back in again. Now we open this up. Ah, I get it. I get it. So what we want to do is this is teaching us that we can push things into a portal. But the problem is, is it pushed it in the direction that we were facing. So we, uh, I unfortunately scuppered the trap slightly. So what we're going to do is we're going to redo it all slightly. Um, I think what I want to do is push it in from above. And then move in to the right. And then push it left. There we go. And it even uh, leaves an extra gap. So we can still get down. And then we get ourselves another key. Excellent. So, I mean, I'm getting lots of keys. I'm, I'm achieving all of my goals. 
We're going to use up three keys to get through here. This is going to require a star. And we have already seen where the star is. Oh, oh, never mind. There's more than one star. Yes. Is there anything else here? I don't think so. So far, no invisible secrets. And I, I kind of appreciate that. I, I don't mind invisible secrets, but I do get kind of tired of them. All right, we can walk on this. Oh, it's a turtle. Turtle is uh, helping us. Hmm. So now we can choose our destination and we have an overworld map. I'm really glad I actually didn't spoil this for myself. I'm kind of sorry I'm spoiling it for you now. But uh, yeah, we have an overworld map. And a new island. Visit the stony cliffs. I'm getting all kinds of achievements right now. Can't push that. Can't do it. Don't even try, bud. These kill us, right? Yeah. I like to I like to experiment. Also, hmm. I just noticed something. The snake eyes in the corners of the screen flash when I enter that space. And I'm wondering why. Why is that? Because they don't flash on this screen and it I was thinking maybe it indicates that there's something yet unclaimed on the map on that screen, but it's not indicating that because there's a key on this map. So maybe it's indicating the star specifically? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um there's lots of things that, ooh, okay. And that is now blocked. Okay. So opposite of a pit trap, these are these become obstacles that you can no longer walk back through. So now I would love to get to that bell. I think what we want to do is we want to go there and then push this in like this. And then we can ring the bell and then come back still. And what do we get? A gem or some kind of thing, crystal. So this is something we, oh, we can push it through crystals. Ah, learning things. Oh, but then the crystals come back, right? Because we're still walking on them, right? That makes sense. Um, well, that's interesting. I'm, I'm wondering if there's any crystals on this uh, map that we could push them through. Can we push them to the next screen? No, we can't. Okay, so elements on the screen stay on the screen. You know, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. This is the kind of thing I would put in if I wanted to like you know, wanted the player to follow the the contours of a spiral for some kind of secret code. I don't know. I don't know, bud. All right, listen, we've we've got a key. Let's uh, explore this zone. Um, okay, I, I hmm, there's some interesting things happening here because obviously I want to go ring that bell, right? As soon as I step on that blue uh, mass, then there's going to be crystals and they're going to be blocking me. Um, but I could then move the block on the crystals, but now I can't get back yet. Right. But the problem is, is that over here, I haven't revealed the pit trap yet. Right. So if I go over here and ring this bell, that's all nice and well. Oh, okay. You can, oh, okay. It's teaching me something new. You can push a log onto a pit trap and it immediately springs the trap when we got us ourselves a second crystal. This is why I love these kind of games is like you discovery is like paramount to my enjoyment. I just really appreciate learning things. Um, and the ways and the methods that uh, games like this teach you are really fun. They're just like really engaging to me. So this floor is interesting. I wonder what happens when you push a log onto a spike trap. Nothing, right? Yeah, nothing. We have to reset that now. Um, I don't think that there's anything I can do on this map yet because I can't really... I can't do anything with these stones. Oh, what? There was something there and I didn't notice it? Okay, interesting. I, I didn't know there was a thing there. Now that's going to make me want to explore like every single tile. 
alas there is nothing else we can't really do anything with this log there's different stones there's yellow stones and blue stones but neither of them really do anything for us um can't open this can't do anything with these logs can't push one log into another um can't get the pressure plate okay we're, we're done here i think i think we're done there okay we've got a we've we've got our first musical note and now we have a series of xylophone keys okay i got you so it's just a, it's a new lock we've got a cave I think we come in here and we open that and then we leave maybe that's something we'll come back to later and it's maybe a shortcut we don't have three keys we can't open that up i, I really do I, I feel like i should explore every tile now yeah there's something here aha there is a little eye of uh what is that eye of um i can't remember which raw is it i think it's raw but we got ourselves a new gem new gems who dis okay so there are like very faint clues written in the ground oh this is where we came in okay uh is there anything on this map to tell me i mean there's obviously grass grass might cover things and then we don't know everything I'm just wondering now that I have a bit more context maybe I need to use this block down here to uh, explore in a, in a new way oh, I, I, I messed it up actually sorry hold on push that up push this to the right uh, ring the bell right so okay yeah i know that this is all stuff we've already seen but hear me out okay hold on hear, hear me out we move this to over here i think we actually have to move this up over here right because i want to see what's un under this crystal if anything i don't know if i can actually do anything with that never mind never mind I, I i i might just be overthinking this okay i i'm in a hurry to discover all of the secrets that this game has to offer and there's really no reason to to do that there's a fun little guy written in the ground in grass um okay uh hmm well, uh, obviously, we want to get to that pressure plate. The problem is that once we push this log over there, it's going to be inaccessible to the second log. A difficult problem to have. Oh, but what we should do... Okay, what we do is we push this over here so we can get rid of that pit trap. And then we push this onto the pressure plate. Yeah, and then, oh, that's interesting. These are going to become inaccessible on my way back. And so, therefore, interesting. Hmm. Well, let's just get our, our, our gem. We'll ring this anyway. But I'm pretty sure uh, now we can't we, we we are hosed in that so we'll, we'll, I'll come back Does any now the bell doesn't stay rung, okay An interesting puzzle to solve here. I think I need that second log to be the sacrifice Oh wait a minute wait a minute, okay hold on We come over here and we dump this in the pit then we come over here and we're going to push this log on the pressure plate right 
Then we can ring the bell and still access it because we have this block. This will help us get back. And that gets us the second key. Well, I say key. It's a it's a some kind of gem, which we we don't know what those do yet. But uh, I'm definitely just scouring. I I want all of the things, all of the time. I don't know if there's anything else on this screen. We'll come back to that. Come back to this. This is something we can't do much with. Can we go up here? Oh, this is something. Oh, okay. Ah, that's what we use the gems for. Like I said, this game doesn't have combat at all. Worth noting that. And, uh, good. I, you know, I, I would like to have more games like this. Okay, interesting. So... Uh, I obviously want that... Hold on. I push that there and that there. Then, oh, oh, except I'm trapped. Now. Oh, no, I'm not trapped. Nice. So we got that, but what does it do for us? Oh, we can open that and get an, our fifth gem. Excellent. Okay, um, I think we're... No, I don't know if we're done on this screen because there's a... There's still a key. I want the key. Let's try and get the key. So all I'm going to do is prioritize the key. Sometimes you can't solve every puzzle right away. I, I was wondering what those did because I'm like, oh, I can walk on them. So they're they're fine, but they're they're not necessary. Oh, interesting. Interesting. OK, so those blue crates don't actually fill a pit hole. OK, so that means that I can't actually do anything on the screen because I don't think there's any log that I can access. Unless there's one hidden here. I don't see. I don't think so. Okay, we're looking for one more gem. Oh, but we can open these now, right? So that's a new ability I've gotten. So there are unlockable abilities in this game. It's not just like um, learning, like, I don't know, puzzles that uh, give you access to other floors, you know? Because that's, you know, that's the witness method is like, teach the player like show the player a puzzle that they don't have all of the answers for yet and then um eventually give them those answers dribble dribble out the answers um i would like to use this log but it looks like i'm not going to be able to use it for anything other than this but we, now we have this log potentially Gosh, all of these logs, like, are, are insisting on being sacrificed. Well, let's just worry about it later. So, what's your deal? Oh, you, you ran away, actually. Okay. Can I push things while I'm on a ladder? I can. But I don't know what the point of that was. Because I could have just pushed it down here. I guess it would have... I, I don't know. I don't know what the point was of that. Aha! We got ourselves another gem. And oh, and another note. And there's something up here as well. What is this? Nothing, it seems like. Nothing yet. Um, and now we've come into this puzzle and we've reset the puzzle except where we've, we've come in at a new angle So what I'd like to do is get this key seems like a free key to me And I noticed there's another gem. That's interesting because I thought I only needed six So why don't we use this log to block this pit come down um, then I'm gonna, oh, hmm. No, okay, I get it, I get it. Then I'm gonna come over here. 
and we're gonna come back over here and use this log on that and then we push this log there and we get the gem cool i don't know why we need seven but okay so that character is over there and they, now they are inaccessible unless we have five stars the stars uh, i feel like are gonna be harder to get <clears throat> what did that do So this is a, a new thing. Seems like, I don't know, maybe uh, I'll have the ability to unlock all of those stones. Lots of things we're learning. We're learning so many things. These a recesses feel like they are meant to be used. Oh, interesting. Hmm. I love the music in this game. It's like super tranquil. This is a this is really a classic game. Like I could have seen this game uh, come out on like the Game Boy, like OG Game Boy. It would have been in like a black and green or whatever. But you know, it would have been on the Game Boy. Where are we? Oh, we're over here. Oh, we can unlock that. I think those stay unlocked. Like I'm pretty sure those are forever unlocked. I was really expecting those mushrooms to do something. I haven't been paying attention to the snakes, but the snake is, uh, their eyes are lit on this screen and on this screen. Like there's definitely something going on on these screens and I should make a note of them, but, uh, you know, Oh, okay. There are secret hidden secrets yet. And yet I can't do anything with this just yet. But okay, we've got si he, uh, hidden secrets and I, I can tell actually there's a purple outline Looks like we can't do anything on that. So maybe the snake indicates a hidden aha a secret Mmm, okay interesting So it looks like the snake's eyes have actually uh, faded now. So that maybe that means there's no more secrets on that floor. Yeah, I think that is what it means. But there's still secrets on this floor. I assume maybe I'll get an ability later that will allow me to take advantage of that floor. I thought I opened this. Oh no, this is a different area completely. Wait, snakes, I, oh, right. This, I haven't fully explored this room. So I can't do anything with this room. It was just kind of disappointing. I really thought I was going to be able to do something here, but maybe this is just a shortcut. Can't do anything on this room either. A lot of rooms in these caves that I can't interact with yet. But now I am paying special close attention to those snake size and uh, it looks like there's no more secrets. Okay. Well, let's go visit that god um, and see if we get any reward. Three keys if we can get through that area up top did i visit this i didn't did i miss this door i guess i did i don't know i'm getting kind of lost now let's go visit this god i might call the video there i really don't want to spoil too much of this game but yeah, you, you've got enough gems now, mister. Aha! You have unlocked your portion of the door. Gotcha. Any cool rewards for me? Awaken the stone elementals. Oh, new mechanics. I was a little bit worried. I was like, oh, is there actually going to be combat? Like, is this a guy I have to avoid or he'll kill me? But no, it's a, it's a new kind of thing. Oh, and then we've got this. I love these kind of puzzles where... 
the the object can't stop moving i love it one of my favorite kind of uh mechanics so how do we get i want to i want to get him to break this log over here hold on i can do this i know i can hold on we're gonna we're gonna reset this room what we want to do is we want to push this there no hold on hold on i'm, I'm just thinking um push it like there i don't know what happens when we push these golems into the uh boxes so we're gonna find out we're gonna find out uh, this game's really addictive actually ah okay so they push them that is totally fine so what all i want to do really is um mm, this is tricky This is really tricky, actually. I really just want to push the golem. Maybe. Oh, okay. I think I see it. He's beginning to believe. Um. Hold on. Hold on. I'm. 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 Th I think I see it. If I push him there, push him over there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Then we push him up there. And now before I push him down, what we're going to do is we're going to push this log there. Clever puzzles. Love it. Love this. Get, get ourselves another key. All right. I'm going to call it there. I, listen, I, it's, it's half an hour, 30 minutes, but... I feel like I blasted through quite a lot of this game, but there's a lot more to, to play here. I really just don't want to like puzzle games are tricky because I if I do badly, then it's a difficult video to watch. But if I do really well, then I spoil a lot of the puzzles. But I hope that this is enough to get you invested in, in wanting to try this game, um, but not enough that I spoil too much of the game. You know what I mean? But anyway, this is Isles of Sea and Sky. I'm going to be playing a lot of this. Um, maybe it'll be deck uh, verified. I can I can try it on my deck. But I, I love these kind of games. And thank you so much, Dev, for, for throwing a key my way. And uh, I, I look forward to whatever they make next because they, they just make really good games. Um, if you enjoyed this, definitely hit the like button. Consider subscribing for more content like this. Check out the link in the description for uh, Isles of Sea and Sky. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.